What's going on YouTube? How you guys doing today? So today I'm here to unbox and review and show you the on foot of the Jordan Mars 270 black, gold, and white. Just before I get into showing you these sneakers um, and what they look like, you know, I like to talk a little bit about just everyday life things, you know what I'm saying? Have you ever been in a situation where, you know, you have a job and stuff like that, but uh, you're always thinking, man, I need to work for myself. I need to get a job my own job i need to be my own boss i don't know about you guys but i don't like working for anybody you know what i'm saying i don't care who it is you know what i'm saying i don't care if it's uh if, if it's if it's bill gates or if it's if it's this person or that person there's always some sort of issue when they work for people you know what i'm saying everybody's human you know what i'm saying people make decisions every minute you know it could be a moody decision it could be a decision that uh it's been happening over a few months or it could be uh situations that they're going through that makes people make decisions that that affect you or the people around you and i'm talking about you know bosses and managers that you know have people under them you understand what i'm saying so for example if you have a manager you have a boss and they like somebody else over you they can promote that person to the next position over you you understand what i'm saying you could be the most hard-working person the most uh a punctual person and that is not good enough you could have been waiting to be promoted to that position and the manager or the boss picks somebody that he likes over you just because the person is his friend or something like that um these things happen you understand what i'm saying but this is the type of things that you know I've, I've experienced that makes me want to be an entrepreneur for myself because i think that this this type of thing happens to people every day people that deserve to go to the next to be promoted people that deserve to, to be given a job uh people that go to interviews and they do a very good interview and the the manager or the, the knows that they deserve to get that job but they don't get it because he has someone else in mind that there's maybe his friend but that's not even close that doesn't even have you know the credentials or the experience that you have but this guy is picked over you because that manager or that the person that's hiring likes how this person talks or likes uh, such and such, but not, they're not even good workers, you know what I'm saying? So these are everyday things that people experience. And I myself, you know, I, I've decided to find new ways to be a, an entrepreneur experiencing something like this, you know what I'm saying? Um, I'm sure I'm not the only one. And one of those ways to do that is, is to go on YouTube, you know what I'm saying? And uh, if anybody, if you ever think of maybe making money and i think this is the reason why a lot of people are on youtube to be their own boss i don't know the reason why you guys are on youtube but i'm sure probably the same reason for me maybe extra money there are people on youtube that make that much money on youtube that are rich off of youtube okay and there are people on youtube also that make enough on youtube to buy a house okay buy cars and there's some people on youtube that make enough just to pay their rent, you know, uh, and that'll just get them by. And there's some people that make so little on YouTube that they have to have another job, okay? There's all kind of incomes on YouTube, but it's possible to bring your own entrepreneur. And this is one of the reasons why I got into YouTube in order to be my own entrepreneur. I think it's a good thing, you know, you could do things at your own time, at your own convenience, you don't have anybody looking over you. You don't have anybody uh, telling you what to do. Uh, and it's just the best thing. You know what I mean? So, either way, let's get into these sneakers, guys. The Jordan Mars 270 Low, okay? Black, gold, and white. All right? I've already reviewed one sneaker on my channel already. The 270 Lows, okay? I want you guys to go check it out. I'm probably going to put the information uh, at the end of my video. Click onto my videos and you'll see two, another review of the 270 Mars Low that I've done already. Okay, let's get into it. And let's talk about these 270 Lows, black, gold, and white. You, you, guys, you guys know I love the 270s because they combine with different sneakers. Let's take a look at it. Let's see what it looks like. Let me give you guys a 360, all right? Let me 
show you the bottom and let me show you the top okay now guys I've mentioned this before when I did a review on the Jordan's Mars 270 I said the Jordan Mars 270s are designed okay with a combination of different Jordans put together okay the Jordan 4s the 1s the 6 all right these Jordans are placed together in order to create these okay but these particular ones are the Jordan Mars 270 lows all right and you can notice that by noticing this dip over here okay when I mentioned that the 6 were one of the sneakers that was incorporated into the Jordan Mars 270 this one I, I find I find it hard to to find the sixes there because on the 270 the regular ones there was a tab here okay this tab has been removed however the 270 lows come with these tabs over here that says Mars okay and it's got the Jordan logo on the top right there these come with the 270 bubbles the Air Max 270s I don't know about the quality of these bubbles but um, if you wear them every day they, you got a chance of busting them after a few months so just just watch out for that these are all made of suede the black and gold ones are all made of all suede all right this gray part right here is all suede these black part is made of all suede all right um the jordan mars 270 regular ones they come with they come very tightly laced but these particular 270 lows are very easy to unlace all right so you're not gonna have a hard time trying to unlace it like the 270 the regular ones all right take a look at the bottom of that these soles are very icy i've always said it okay i love the gold jordan logo on the tongue that's dope to me all right i love this plastic part right here that says, says 270 I, I think that's the best part one of the best part of the 270s i love that design how it says 270 right there um take a look at the gold nike swoosh logo okay on both sides this sneaker right here is a beautiful sneaker i think the jordan 270 mars i think they're dope cakes on their own but when they came out with these lows i was like damn i'm in love with these i fell in love with these as soon as i saw them they look so dope on feet these look like they got good quality you know what i'm saying to me you know and i'm talking about the bottoms are made of rubber uh and, and you know obviously most of the part of the upper sneaker is made of suede uh however uh the reason why i think it's it's, it's, it's got good quality is because of, like i said again the rubbery soles um the bottom the bottom to me it, it looked like they could, they could be some good kicks but like i said if you want to wear something that is jordans that are jordans affordable and dope on feet these jordan mars 270 are definitely the way to go all right i've not come to the end of my video guys thank you for watching my video if you're new to this channel please click that subscribe button and if you're not uh you know what to do click that like button click that share button I want to thank everybody again for watching my video. And on to next time. Just maybe. Just maybe. I might see you with these on. Or maybe I might not. Who knows? One easy.